What's up guys, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak iOS 14.8. If you haven't updated to iOS 14.8 yet and you're on a lower firmware and you're catching this video when it comes out, you have two days to do it, so you can do it if you want. There's also a couple of other important things to note as well. This jailbreak currently only works on A12 and A13 devices, so the iPhone XS series and the iPhone 11 series. However, right now, for some reason, there is no Uncover 14.8 iPad support yet, so if you try to run this jailbreak on 14.8 on an iPad, it will not work as of the recording of this video. That will likely be fixed in the future, but as of right now, there is no iPad support. With that out of the way, if you have a supported device, let's go ahead and get started. So obviously, you want to go ahead and download all server for your computer, then once it's installed, go ahead and open it up. And if you're on Mac, open the Mail app and enable the Alt Server plugin. You can plug your phone into your computer. Also, in Finder and on iTunes, make sure to show this iPhone when on Wi-Fi is checked. And then from there, you can go over to Alt Server and where it says Install Alt Store, you're just going to press on your device. Then obviously, enter in your Apple ID, username, and password. It's going to go through. You might get this message. Just go ahead and press continue. And then you'll see Alt Store will actually sideload on your device. So here is Alt Store. And now we're going to go ahead and open it. And it's going to ask us if we want notifications and if we want to connect to the network just go ahead and press ok on both now we're going to have to sign in with our apple id on the actual app so do that then go to uncover.dev on your device and go to where it says open in alt store and go ahead and tap on open. now it's just going to load and it's going to side load the uncover app then once it does that and it finishes you should see uncover on your device as well and normally we'd be good to go However, with this version of Uncover, it gives us a notice that says, please enable airplane mode and disable Wi-Fi to proceed with the jailbreak process. So obviously from there, it's pretty simple. Just turn on airplane mode and the jailbreak should go through. And actually the first time I did this, the jailbreak actually failed. I'm assuming maybe that's because I didn't have airplane mode on in the beginning, but it might fail. Just keep that in mind. Jailbreaks initially, sometimes they fail. You just have to keep at it. And eventually, obviously, it's going to work. So here on the second time with airplane mode turned on in the beginning, we're going to go ahead and jailbreak the device. And here it's going to go through. For some reason, it stays on 2 of 22 for a little while. So I sped that up. And now it says jailbreak completed. The system needs to reboot to finish the jailbreak process. When your device reboots, rerun the jailbreak to complete the process. So that's the end of the first step. Now we have to just go ahead and do that again for a second time. So again, in the beginning of this, make sure airplane mode is toggled on and go ahead and tap on the jailbreak button. And from here, it's gonna go through and it's gonna install the rest of the required files in order to have the jailbreak. And this 14.8 jailbreak caught most of us by surprise, but it's exciting because now it feels like the community is excited and jailbreaking again. It might not be for iOS 15 versions like we maybe were hoping for initially, but this is the best we're going to get right now, and eventually an iOS 15 jailbreak will come out. But yeah, here we go. Uncover your Cydia. Now we actually have to turn airplane mode off in order to actually get Cydia to work. So let me just go ahead and do that. Now if we press reload, here is Cydia and it is running on an iOS 14.8 iPhone 11. If you updated a 14.8 via the delay OTA profile and you want to get this iPhone is supervised and managed message off of your iPhone, it's pretty easy to do that. All you have to do is just install the original tweak that you installed to get to 14.8. And then once I actually installed it, the message for me went away. But if it doesn't go away right away for you, all you have to do is just navigate to the settings and disable supervision spoofing. And then from there, once you open the settings again, you can see it is no longer there. Well, now you can finally use Uncover on 14.8 with an AirTag if you've had one laying around for the past six months. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you did enjoy, please make sure to hit that like button. Also, go ahead and subscribe and turn on that post notification bell so that way you never miss out on a brand new upload. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good one, guys. Peace.